Now, Jim, I think we can all feel it. There is tension brewing between these two. Oh, it is no, quite no, extraordinary. They used no, to be tight as. No tensions. I mean, tight. laces. No, where no, do you think no, the name no, came no, from? They're out. Uh, I got they, told. They were rejected. A little, uh, a little birdie Expunged. told me that maybe there was a blue last night on the footy oh, show. Okay, he treaded very, very dangerously last night. Well, I didn't hear it, but I'm going to hear it now, please. If Alistair was to go, and he's not, but if he was to contemplate the Melbourne offer, it is a six year arrangement that has been put to him. And uh, Melbourne knows he's not going to take it, but that is the figure, that is the term that Melbourne has offered <laughs> Alistair Clarkson. Oh, what do you six, say about that? Six years. Or no comment? Significant well, offer. I can't comment. I, you know I can't comment on these no, sorts of things. No, I don't know that at all. Well, Gary. I, I it. thought you were on the <laughs> footy show panel as a representative, and if we asked you a question, you might uh, do what we ask everyone else to do, who we ask questions of, under, and that's answer them. Under normal circumstances, I would Six say years. Um, it would be $40 million you'd have to pay. They you know he's not going to take it, though, Sam, and that, that's Damien the situation there. Oh, so well, well, you could say it's not then. the case, Gary, if it's not the case. Don't get snappy, Doug. No, well, well, I'm, I'm just saying. I'm happy to have you here. But oh, it's all right. Yeah, pretty quick. <laughs> that is the first fraying of that relationship, oh, yeah. and no, it continues. No, that's not true. That frayed about a week and a half ago, <laughs> to be perfectly honest. And I just, all I would say on that is that he's been the most impressive newcomer to television, uh, our man Damien Barrett, in the past year and a half. And he can be the most impressive outgoing if he continues with that. <laughs> have he, you, young Mark Stevens. Mark you, Stevens is going beautifully, and I'm in, uh, watching him closely. <laughs> have you lost your humour, the lone wolf? Because it's a different version of you. Uh, I've just tried to distance mm. myself in the studio because he doesn't seem happy, Jim, our man, the wolf, at the moment. He's no. different countenance to him. No, absolutely. I, I have will, you lost your humour? I'm putting my hand up, Duke. The, the, the little humour that I've had in life has slowly <laughs> ebb, ebbed away, and... It, What's worn me down is the talking, because I just generally don't like doing it, and that's all I've done for three weeks, and it's talked the humour out of me, to be perfectly honest. If you want the honest answer, Duke, yes, indeed it has. And Damo? I'm a, I'm a touch weary tonight, and I might have to go early. Is it a little bit early for the wolf to be sick of talking about it, given there's still a long journey <laughs> well, ahead? How's he going to be hey, further down the track? And given that your club has taken away the man they desperately wanted to coach as a starting point. It's a scary but true proposition, <laughs> Chief. There's no Where do you go from here, end wolf? in sight. But, hey, I'm tired tonight, but I'm up for it. I'm ready to go to, but tomorrow. Don't worry. I'll be back. Um, carry on. I've got an I'll email, just, but um, I don't know what it is. Duke, every now and then, and, and, a, and a coach like Alistair Clarkson has earned it, every now and then you can have the perfect storm. Yeah. Every now and then you can just have a couple of mobs wanting you at the right time. It happens in television too. Just never has with me. <laughs> Where uh, as you're easing out of your contract, you just have another mob and another mob suddenly go, I wouldn't mind a piece of him. And an extra fair slap can land on your table without you doing anything. Well not deserved. courting it, no. not saying anything, staying and doing exactly what you're doing, and suddenly you find your figure a hell of a lot healthier. That is your perfect scenario. Mm. Yes, and God, wouldn't we all love to be in that situation, Jim? I'm going to keep going until well, I, reckon, I, I reckon there's one. <laughs> okay. I reckon there's one in the studio. You might get finished up well before then. I reckon not. there's one in the studio that's enjoying a similar scenario. Oh, right oh. Now. The big juke, them. I think Duke. the planets have just aligned for oh, our man uh, beautifully. Yeah, it's a minute. nice handball away from yourself there. Uh, well, oh, come on, I'm sick of talking about that. Ride that wave all the way to the beach, Duke. <laughs>